New tonight after residents in a Poway neighborhood were terrorized in a string of suspicious crimes back in January. They're feeling some relief this evening. The suspect has been caught and is sitting in jail tonight. Fox 5's Kasia Gorchik is live downtown where the man will make his first appearance in court tomorrow. She has reaction from residents in Poway. Kasia. Hi, good evening, Kathleen, and I spoke to several neighbors tonight who say they really noticed a lot of stepped up patrols and attention on this crime after our initial story aired with that surveillance video. The sheriff's department was then able to positively identify the suspect and tonight news of that man's arrest is really great news for these neighbors who spent the last two months on edge. Uh, yeah. He said, hey, I just want to let you know we got the guy. You can let the kids know. You know, they could sleep well tonight. He's being booked downtown. It's the news Daniel Justand and his neighbors had been waiting for since late January. 33 year old Corey Miracle behind bars booked for burglary and vandalism. It was kind of nerve wracking there for a little bit every now and then. I mean, the fact that I can drive down our streets and not look at every person that's walking down the road to see if he looks familiar is going to be nice. It was just Ann's home surveillance cameras that caught the suspect in his home while his family was sleeping. They could be seen both inside and outside the home, piling on several bags filled with soccer gear and some electronics. The man seen on video is also tied to several cars on the same street being vandalized or broken into during that same night. Just days after the video was shared, detectives had a suspect name, Corey Miracle. I was thrilled when they knew who it was. I was kind of happy that it was a local kid because then I knew we were going to catch him. The development provided some hope, but it still took a while to track the man down. Now that he's in custody, Justand is thankful he and his neighbors spoke out and stood up for their neighborhood. Immediately had patrol on our street. It did help bring our neighborhood together and at least know to look out for each other. And a big goal in sharing their story were those extra patrols. So again, neighbors are really thankful. They definitely feel very heard by the sheriff's department. And as for Miracle, he will be arraigned here at the courthouse at 8 a.m. tomorrow. Reporting live downtown, Kasia Grigorczyk, Fox 5 News.